スーパーロボ対戦アルファトリーカー It's Boys Appakin and Giant Robots Welcome back to Super Robot Wars Alpha Dreamcast You know, previously it was like a whole last week ago But I think It was a resurrection Of like seven angels Seven apostles who shouldn't have come back to life. So there's a shenanigan afoot. Shinji went berserk. Unit 1 went down into dogma. And... I'm doing my best with translating. Please forgive me if I'm wrong. Shin getter. Okay. What is this thing behind the menu? Hmm. Just about to speak, I had just uncontrollable burping. Alright. Unit 1 has managed to break through the back of light layers and get down pretty dang deep. But, so have the rest of the crew. And everyone's ready to start blowing away any barriers that's in the way. Bright makes sure everyone... Or no, Bright makes sure Masato's ready to do this. But she says her feelings don't matter. Gendo needs to be stopped, or what he's doing is going to become irreversible. After some noise and some screeching and some explosions, the Yutsuki is here confiding in Kaji, of all people. He claims Gendo is being reckless as ever, but just as the Dead Sea Scrolls stated, the STMC are here, and all intelligent life will be denied. Kaji muses that Gendo is trying to use the Lance of Longinus to leave behind proof of people's lives in the next world. But in the end, doing this is just denying one branch in countless parallel universes. But life has its ways, and Kaji and Futsuki will be reborn and do the same things. As per Kaji, Sele wanted the same ending of Death and Rebirth for the world, which is why they wanted to mess with the schedule given by the Dead Sea Scrolls. Sele trusted Gendo with the Instrumentality Project, but coming into contact with Ingram and Uses, Sele knew that there would be risks of Gendo acting on his own. Sele even had Kaoru and the mass production Ava's as trump cards. Further assault from outside of the zoo. The back of light layer inside Terminal Dogma is starting to melt, but Heaven's Door, you know, take your JoJo jokes where you want them, is alive and well. Hero radios in, citing he'll be launching another attack on the back of light. You know. It's about time for that, uh, triple buster rifle shot. Despite Misato's concerns, the team continues their assault on the back of light. Misato denies the use of the twin buster rifle, or even Shin Getter 2's drill, worried that they will get trapped during the process. There's got to be another way! Back over here with Kaji, Kaji and Fuyutsuki, Kaji quotes something that he learned while working with the Lon Nobel. The fate of the world should be cited by the people who live in it. Things do not always go to plan. But do the Lon Nobel have the right to do what they think is right? Kaji counters that they could rule the world, but that's not how they want to use their power. At which point, Kaji raises a gun. It's completely possible to stop the world from speeding into the end. Just how the Londo Bell thwarted the mass production Ava's and stopped the instrumentality project. And he is sure that they'll stop the STMC and change history. Aji has come here to open the door. At the least, he can trust the future to the Londo Bell. Everyone else here, all those involved, should be the only ones to be facing the end. 
soon enough. But the door opens. Yutsuki claims that he has the right to struggle against fate, but he also maintains the right to stand by and watch. He will no longer stand in Kaji's way. Inata reports that Heaven's door has been opened. Kaji calls in shortly after wanting Misato's help later, but for now, help Shinji. Kaji. Oh. Ooh, that's uh, one hell of a super typo. Wow. I love how I juxtapo juxtapose letters like that. That was that was bad. Kaji also promises if he gets to meet up with him again, he'll tell Misato what he couldn't eight years ago. Uh, hold on. Of course, his signal goes dead. Time to get the boys down to the central dogma now that the doors are wide open. Gendo, Ray, and Ritsuko stand before one another. Ritsuko has been waiting and draws a gun on Gendo. Ritsuko admits to opening Heaven's door and even reprogramming the Magi. However, Ritsuko's final trump card fails. As she says, a mother has chosen a man over her own daughter. Gendo draws his own gun. Here. Bang. Stage 67. Toji Yukusekai. The Closing World. Oh, look at this again. Gendo stands before Lilith, ready to fuse Adam and Lilith together. All to meet Huey once again. Ray is also here, about ready to fall apart. <coughs> Gendo tells Ray to throw away her body, release the wall of her heart, unite the souls. But Ray rejects him. Shinji is calling. Even though Unit 1 has appeared, even, well, this was part of the plan. That's redundant now that I uh, read what I wrote. Though so Unit 1 is. <sighs> no, I don't need those. Unit 1 has appeared, but even this was part of the plan. Hold on, a formatting problem. Right, okay. We'll fix my formatting on my file. Kind of important. Ba -ba -ba. Unit 1 has appeared, but even this was part of the plan. The, that's why Shinji was put inside Nilla's alter ego, Unit 1. Now, to use his and Shinji's missing hearts to compliment everyone. And, like, going between complimentation, human complimentation and instrumentality is a little difficult because everything in the, trans in the script says human complimentation, but the dub has always been instrumentality. But also, give me the Grand Garant. Take 17. 
Uh, Noriko. Combat Vu. Voltez. Koji. Shinobu. Team Getter. The MC. Why can't I read that? Sutondo. 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 Huh? I. I do not recognize this shit. Hold on. I, this, this, this is highlighted? I don't recognize that. Or that pilot. What am I looking at? Destroyed monster. It, it's because the characters are spaced out so weirdly. Okay, we got Bondo. Get in there. Get her one. No, thank you though. Oscar, get in there. Probably gonna need the V two. Huh. Masky. To grab. Before I fuck this up. Todd, show. If there's not anyone else I want to take. Valkyries will not do me any good here. So I think... Considering we're high upon endgame. R1. R gun. Three, R two. All right. See, ta -ta -ta. Gendo's ready to open the room. Calf when assigned to deploy. Once everyone's on the field, everyone thinks that it's the that the berserk unit one has been tamed. But as it turns out. Gendo is on board, probably standing on top of it as opposed to inside of it. Reading say that Shinji's vitals are near zero. Gendo beats the Londo Bell, stating that it's time for all souls to discard the shackles of the body and become one. This is instrumentality. All of humanity becomes one perfect individual. Misato explains that humanity is the 11th, <clears throat> the 18th angel. Humanity was all born of Lilith, and the other angels were all just other possibilities. 500,000 years ago, the protoculture abandoned their human forms to escape from the STMC. And they became essentially the same species as them. Which is to state that the angels were once human. And with each appearance they made, they were trying to return to human form. Which is, in time, how we get to Kaoru. Of course, Kaoru, as an angel, knew about the Zentradi's weakness to song, which is why they were given ancient plaint with the lyrics to the song to make things progress. Gendo finally chimes in. It says humans are sad people who have no choice but to reject one another. A mental wall. An anti-terror field. We cannot understand one another. Armour attempts to refute this, but Gendo counters! What have new types done so far? They are the innovators of humanity. Even after the One Year War, people continue to fight. And new types are simply used for war. Just like Lala Soon. Ooh, 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 get, ooh, take, take a critical, take a critical there, Quattro. 
Manjo asks if Gendo thinks he's got the right to force humanity into one entity. And Gendo says that life is always seeking evolution, more so when the environment is changing. The progress in the space made the Meganoids. The one year war triggered the development of enhanced humans, which he's probably referring to Siren new types. Humanity has been able to manipulate the genes of other life forms and change evolution at will. And now, again, humans are being encouraged to evolve by the STMC. Even the Zentroni and Miltroni are based on the original human form. But humanity cannot escape its fate of destruction. I suppose I'm glad I see this this is this is my my, my check. Once I read over, it's like, oh no, that word's not right. Humanity cannot escape its fate of destruction so long as it remains a human. The protoculture gave up their forms and still survive to this day. The Room of Galf, or better known, rebirth from Lilith, the source of life. Banjo makes a call out. Anyone who has given up their human form is no longer human. Just like Meganoids and Megaborgs. And nobody else wants to become some kind of monster like the angels. Shinobu sure as shit doesn't care if it's space monsters or flying tempura, so long as he is sure he can fight with his own hands. That's fine enough for him. Members of the rest of the team chime in about how it is human to clash with one another, then come to an understanding and be individuals. Gendo realizes he's made a mistake. Our AT fields are just too powerful. Misato warns Gendo one last time to give back Shinji. No, no. He's been taken into Unit 1 as a child. It is thus impossible to rescue him. It's possible that Misato orders Unit 1 to be recognized as the enemy. However, the ultimate goal is to stop Gendo's plan to rescue Shinji. The team are all in. All in or not, enjoy a mass production. So, we can get skill points here. Uh... Hold on. Wait, what? Oh, no. I... Pfft, that was the last stage. I wrote, there are no skill points here. Skill points are done. Oh, no. Oh, no, I didn't bring... Oh, no. Ah. <sighs> I can't send the SRX because or someone's have to bench. Uh uh. Uh who could I bench? Because I'm gonna have to re-roll this. Uh who gets benched? Siki baby? Wings of Light is at 18. Ah! Uh... I'll be right back. I'll, I'll figure this out. Okay. Wait. No. I shouldn't have come back in. Dang it. Oh, we'll just hold start to this. 
much ado about blah blah blah. Alright, now. Are we allowed? Are you? Oh no, y'all may not be close enough. Hmm. So it's not foreseen. Ah, thank you. Excellent. Thank you for not fucking me. Sixty. Sixty. There yet. You know what? Y'all can come for me. Da, da, da. Drop one MK. Flat in. Drop one. Spasato. Uh, yeah, drop a Rio. Get it. Position. Slide in position. Wait, no, no, no. Hold on. Uh, get a Daisaku. Also have it. You have Daijiro. Not Daijiro. Kenichi has encouraged. So Throw Daisaku, y'all can hype each other up. Uh Valetta, give me one. Ran in there. Get one from Yona. We can go Tiger King. The Ball of Doom is here. Yep, y'all not moving. Huh. Didn't stop to consider accuracy just yet. Alright. Let's see how bad this goes. Not the flying ones. Fuck <laughs> right off. All right, try this shit again. Did I not intern? No, I didn't. Please dodge. Thank you. All right. 
Okay, yeah, because they only the film so far. Cool. Sick. Now Alright. The hypening. Kasumi, you're ready to go. Not quite ready, but doing it. 130, 20, 10, 10. Sarah. Ah, I know part of that is weird because I didn't throw, I didn't throw this out yet. I'm holding on to it for a surprise. All right, Leona. Ah, oh, they move in waves. That's what it is. Uh, fuck your field. Asuka, can you? Ah, not enough. How's oh, a Tron rifle? Bro. Is it's not post move, but Uso is gonna try a plan. <laughs> Critical could not get through barrier, but okay, fine. That's permissible. Broke through. 
Oh. Box of toe. Breakthrough. Come on! Hyper. Odd, can you do it? Not quite. Oh, I need to really put more into your like energy through barely that but needs a pepsi and a gundam soda feels snowy man oh i have water adjacent beverages hmm don't know how i like that flavor uh, has somebody been touched? Oh, I saw energy used. Let's... One of two things will happen. Those are the mass productions. Somebody didn't go, and I don't know who it was. Huh. That's a pain in the ass. Why? Okay. Shout. Be mad about it. Roll the dice. Fuck. Even with soul. Even with soul. Ass. Pure, unadulterated ass. Guess what? Not going to bother doing that. Huh. No, oh, you, 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 you were right. Those are the mass production Avas. Just... What I was trying to do failed horribly and was a waste of resources. Flash. Not flash. Get the beam! Why are you so bad at hitting? They shouldn't be that dodgy, but what do I know? 
in-game super robot bosses can still dodge anything. A getter beam. through the thought double act so, double act. Watch as Shozama deletes two angels in one fell swoop. I can't get through without hyper? Yup. Excellent. Asuka can do her own shouting. Can you go fast? Ah, you are restricted. Punch. Yes. Um, hmm. Okay. I have a plan. Uh, you, you're still active on that. You're still active on Flash. That's fine. What AT field? Double collider. Nope, nope, nope. You need to land hits. Uh, game.
been hit. But energy levels. What are the odds? 79. Yes. Excellent. Level up. Uh, oh. oh, that's still active. Cool. Go fast. See if this punch goes if beast mode is enough. Yes! Especially that critical. Hmm, really? Really? Okay, let's see if a single Wings of Light is good enough. Gained lead experience. Nothing? Just stood there? Ah, dummy plug and unit one that ran away. Our show. Okay, well, that's, that's a plan, we're doing a bit, Ryoto Flash, Tiger, uh, Dragon Tiger, Tiger King, Tiger, Wave? Pirate Grave? Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Easy mode. Um, wait, no. That's, that's, that's money. That's bread. That's finances. Hold up. I need that money.
don't even have to cast flash. You're not going to hit me. Your money. I want it. For forty K. All right. <clears throat> No skill points, the goal is to destroy everything. And once Berserk Unit 1 is shut down, they quickly recover Shinji and his Ava. But not a moment did they get him back. One starts to feel weird? Cham gets really gross, icky, black aura vibes. Black Aura. Oop, the Psychics are getting bad vibes. Alright, there's an anti-AT field reaction from Lilith. And Unit 1 is reborn. Also, more mass production angels! Everyone say, yo, what, what, why, what, what? That is definitely a different unit one than the one that's in our hangar. The thing out there is 92.4% match for unit one. It's effectively the same as the regenerated angels from before. It seems that no matter what, Gando is damned and determined to stop us here and now. No. He's going to unite humanity. And this is the only way until Gendo's cut off. Multi! But it's not Rome Stoll. It's one of five super small units that can beat that ass without a robot. Albert, the impact. Supposedly, Albert had died a while back? What? Nope. <laughs> Alberto has been Alberto has been lying in wait, waiting for this opportunity. The stop nerve. Alberto says that he will not get in our way, but neither will he be our friend. Sore de mo, regardless, he refuses to let Nerve do as they please. Fate must be chosen by Big Fire and the Londo Bell. Wait, what what is what what is that? What is that? I thought Refrain of the Soul was done. Ava in the hangar just re fucking started and is fully recovered. But the pilot's vitals have also returned to normal. Shinji is back. Kept you waiting, huh? Everyone thought he was absorbed into the Ava, but no, it was his mother within the Ava who lent her strength. And now Shinji is here to help Rei 
and stop his father. I can spell it correctly. No more will this boy run away. Not from his enemy, his role, or his father. Gendo continues his prattling. Right, not a new situation. I just created a space because, man, that's a paragraph. Gendo goes on. Humans cannot escape their fate as written in the Dead Sea Scrolls. It's not important to defeat the STMC, but how to leave proof that they existed in the next world. Humans must give up their bodies and wait for the next rebirth. And in the next life, read the scrolls and cause the third, even the fourth impact if necessary. As life repeats forever with death, evolution, and rebirth. Kind of like an endless... He calls out the Shinji, Borei, and even Yui, who are all waiting for him. Shinji has kept quiet until now, just giving him that. All right, get your get, get your villain speech out. Come on, Dad. What do you what What's your point here? I've heard it all already. Shut up. Until finally, Shinji speaks up. He calls out his father on being the one who's been running away. He's the one who's scared to fight the STMC. Gendo is just acting like Shinji used to, knowing that there are things beyond his control and choosing to run away. Hmm. Gendo acknowledges that you've grown since I put you in the Londo bed. Amuro acknowledges that Shinji found his own place to protect and return to since joining the Londo Bell. Of course, humans have their problems, but clashing and overcoming hardships is human nature. Gendo refutes Amuro! Humanity just keeps making the same ass mistake over and over again. They've been manipulated by aliens to develop military strength, mental evolution, and nothing has come of it all. Humans continue to hurt one another, unable to bear the pain of contact with others. Human evolution has come to a standstill. But Armro claims that people cannot live alone. Ooh, another typo. See, I'm glad I read this back after I write it. And even in becoming one, you simply can't live like that. The angels and humans are different. This is the wrong kind of evolution. Even Hero chimes in, talking about the never-ending dance Gendo spoke about. It's almost like an endless waltz. <laughs> ah, Gendo is sick and tired of words. The Londo Bell can stop him. Then try. Shinji is ready to slug it out with his father. Yo, over here! This man! Albert the Impactal. To all of your 1200 HP! Albert the Impact, welcome to team! Exclusively on the Dreamcast. Axel, Focus, Flash, Great Guts. Um, Cloak. Cloak? I think that one's Cloak. And Soul. Albert somehow has no kills? I don't believe that. And Prevail. Only 100 morale? Man, it sure would be convenient if I had a spell that gave everybody 10 morale. I would have to use two more. Oh, you know what? We not too worried about that. Cause that would max out everyone's SP if I did it. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, all right, so uh, yeah, no one's gonna die here. So 
Shayla. SP. Uh, and we get another one. Let's see. Uh, who's got it? Yeah. Give that to this ray. Do it again. And then. Come over here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Where there's no disturbance. Uh, bolted. Yoshi. Disturbance. Focus over here. Will this get through without soul? <laughs> Fixing his head. No, 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 don't touch the fro. And now you slide in. Chill. Cham. Encourage. Bam. 130. You can do your other move. Focus. Hold on, hold on. You're at 150 now. Is this stupid? Yes. Am I going to try it again? Yes. Prime, welcome. All right, let's get stupid. Oh yeah, you're gone forever. Oh, he doesn't explode, he just whoop, zoops right out. Yup. Wait, what about unit one? Ah, oh, we broke through unit one, all right. All that for nothing! Sometimes you gotta try the stupid stuff. But 
I've already got sold up. Wings of Light. Delete this man and his whole career. Oh no! Oh no. Now the target should be destroy unit one, right? Um, destroy them all? Hmm, I think we're ready to destroy them all. Destroy them all. Alright, alright, alright. Little miffed. Not the end of the world, though. But, but wait, d d Uso! Uso! Us? Oh. Yo, go twice. This breaks through. Yes! Ah, uh, fuck right off. Jesus! What if? What if fear? Oh, that was worthless. Smooth brain dumbass. Do it. Get off my map. Done with your shit. Wait. Wait. No. Huh. Wait, did I? I 
think that that's it. That can't be it. Hold on. That's it. I. Uh. Huh? Oh, man. Cut through that AT. Gets butter. Get turned up. That's not who I wanted. You know what? I'm done. I was gonna wait another turn. Show off Albert. But I have been continuously hit on the most tiniest of percents. I didn't know I was playing XCOM today. Y'all don't have freaking bless. Y'all don't get money or experience on this. You do get experience. Y'all don't get money though. Fuck me. Wait. Daniel though. I was gonna delete everyone. I was gonna get all this money. I'll do it off camera. I'm done with this recording. I'm done with this episode. Get off of my screen! Sick of you. Ah. As is written, only Unit 1 is necessary for the win. Finally defeating Unit 1, run away. As it reads, Gino has finally been waiting for this moment. He says if he were to have been around, he only would have hurt Shinji. So it was better for him to have done nothing. Others, Ray, I guess, seem to be speaking out for Gendo's feelings instead. Being scared, avoiding contact with others, with Shinji, rejecting world before he was hurt by it. However, Kaoru, and whatever he's got going on, compliments Shinji on his heart to now being stronger. And those final words are an apology to Shinji before he and Unit 1 sink into the abyss. Awesome! 
After the fight, Ivan is here, ready to blow away the rest of Nerf headquarters. He reminds Albert that they are to leave the Lama Bell alone. Albert. Albert only listens to orders from one man. And he has scores to settle with some of the Lando Bell crew. Alberto begins with his approach on Daisaku and Genrei. Genrei gets in between them. She says that Daisaku and Giant Robot are needed for the decisive battle. And if need be, she is ready to use that power to stop Alberto if needed. Hour before she's even allowed. Taiso and Tetsuku burst onto the scene. Taiso will stay behind and hold Alberto back while the other three scamper off. Grab that little boy and run. The bridge crew picking up explosions coming from all over Nerve Headquarters. They finally get Genrei and Daisaku on board, but Shinji is still behind. Inata says Shinji went to look for Rei in Unit 1. More explosions rock the boats. The Bright orders all ships to pull back, much to Misato's displeasure. She even offers to go and look for Shinji off on her own. However, the Londo Bell cannot take heavy losses here. If not they, then who else could protect the world? God damn it, Shinji, you better be alright. Taiso and Albert are here slugging it out as two strike a pair of decisive blows. Alberto is sure that he's won. But Taiso is bleeding, making him the victor. Because he is delayed for Shinji to find Rei. However, with that done, Iso asks Shinji to look after Daisaku and protect the world with his power. Even though it seems like a lot for Shinji, he and Rei scamper off. Unfortunately, this leaves Alberto highly dissatisfied. He didn't even get a real fight out of the man. This was not how they were supposed to settle things. Fade to white. Explosion this. Now, let's check something. You need to. Unit one. Uh, unit two, excuse me. Unit one. Unit zero. Unlike in the Dreamcast on the other routes, we get Ray back. Neat. All combat is over. Now that you've tasted victory, I'm sure you'll be back. <laughs> 